give a praise your name. Uh huh. That is in the material. Praise his name. Cause that's how it feels. I would do. Me, 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 and my crew. We're praising the prison of the Lord. When you be on my mission, what show me love? Show me love. Uh, on the Calvary cross. Uh, even when I thought that everything I knew was lost. Come See, he came for me. Came for me cared for me. Cared for not me. only dead, just to die for me. Die for me. Defunging you for what tips of me. And that Mr. one my must be. Yeah. We got to give. Uh -huh. You know we got to pray. Uh -huh. The one who orders step. Come on. Uh. Not me. Not me. Nobody that I deserves my worship. I give it all to you, Baba God. We praise you, we worship, we bow before your throne and say, You changed my life to something beautiful, yeah. Whatever the situation, I say. Welcome back. So I have a very fine gentleman here with me in the studio. And because of him, I have to try and speak some English this morning. So <laughs> allow me, okay, and let's all get flowing. Yeah, so he's Donaldson, Donaldson Saki. Donaldson Saki. He's been a footballer and he's still um, a model. Let me put it like that. He's a model and a fashion, I mean, well-known fashion designer if i'm right if i should use a designer and i hope i am right because he what he is into is what we call streetwear collections i, I don't know but he's here so he <laughs> will tell me more <laughs> about it good yeah. morning Donaldson. Good morning. good morning good to have you nice for the thank you for the invitation all right <laughs> <laughs> so you had it huh we will try <laughs> we get it <laughs> <laughs> okay yeah. So, Donaldson, yeah. uh, before we go into your streetwear uh, clothing line mm. or collection, mm. tell me briefly about you. Because mm. from my little background research, mm. I know you are a Ghanaian. Mm. I can tell that from your name, Saki. <laughs> and then there's uh, Togoli somewhere, yeah. and then a German. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, tell it's true. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm kind of mixed, okay. like. My parents are from Togo, okay. but the background is from, from, from Ghana because of the, also you can hear it of the name Saki. Okay. But we also have a lot of Saki in <laughs> Togo, let's say like okay. this, yeah. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm based in Hamburg in Germany. Okay. And um, I start with uh, football, okay. professional football. Okay. I play for the Togo Leafs national team. Whoa. And now- National team? Yeah, yeah. So you were there? Yeah. I mean that. Yeah. On top. On top. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. So it's like I'm seeing a Samoan kind of, or did they are you? Yeah, I played even against them several oh times. Oh my with God. Ade Bayo okay. at the national team. Okay. I even met him yesterday here. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. So, um, yeah. Now I'm to um, fashion design. Okay. Also modeling. 
Wow. And a part also like architecture. Oh, my yeah, goodness. Yeah. <laughs> a man of many talents. <laughs> so tell me about the switch then yeah. from being a footballer mm. and then at mm. what point did you have to let it go mm. and mm. then do other things? I think just came like that because I was playing and somehow I get somewhere stuck. So I was thinking about to, to have a second platform and the second platform was the fashion because um, I, I have been you always I have been always creative since okay. my youth. Okay. But so uh, football wasn't creative enough because yeah. people don't just leave. I mean, yeah. football yeah. it pays a lot. Yeah. And people are bought and paid in dollars, yeah. euros, yeah. pounds, yeah. all you can think of. Yeah. So for you to really let it go and go into something creative. Yeah, I, I think like football is just for special s scale okay. of time. So after this time, they're still alive. So they're still alive. I so like that. Yeah. Um, yeah, what I was thinking of is to base something which I can do like my whole lifetime on without, you know, getting old uh -huh. and losing the strength. So yeah. I rather lose, uh, use my mind to, to create something. something. Yeah. Wow. When did it start with your um, creative ability? Because all the while you were playing, you mm. were busy playing, mm. training. Mm. And I know it sucks a lot of time because mm. you have to train and train mm. and train. So mm. probably you were not having a time mm. to sit steady or do mm. fashion. Mm. When, 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 when did you start having this? Mm. Um, I think I'm more a person that I need a balance between both. Okay. I cannot do one thing just straightforward. Okay. So apart my football career, I was even studying and also like trying to be creative on my own 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 world let's say like mm -hmm. this like by my own um so i was guessing like oh i need to go out with what i can because i know a lot of people which are very creative are scared to do this step forward okay. to come out so um i was thinking about it and the time came and i just got out and yeah i created my fashion brand wow yeah okay so starting with your first, um, what do you call it? Clothing Clo line. Line, yeah. How was it? The first clothing line. First clothing line was difficult, very difficult because um, uh, being a footballer, yeah. uh, also part modeling, a fashion designers are completely different things. So I need to get into the market, know the right people, trying to to get my my stuff on board showing to people so it was it was a uh, it was very hard at okay. first but when you keep going and you have faith and what you believe on mm -hmm. it that it can be done there there will be a time where it will really be, be done so wow. mm. okay yeah what's the name of the clothing line it's called cp art cp art yeah cp okay. art and okay. uh, my my CP slogan art. is art is life okay so i've choose artist life because I was look at the creation of God and it's like wow. everything you see with your own eyes is somehow art and it's also it's also somehow something which is life mm -hmm. so I put it like art is life wow yeah. okay when did modeling mm. um, how, how did you start it is, did <laughs> it come did it come because you were ready yeah. into um, fashion you yeah. were creating so you decided yeah. to also wear it yeah. and, 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 and show it off no it was rather funny story because I was never thinking of modeling you know I <laughs> knew I love fashion but like modeling I was not thinking about it so um, it was actually I wanted to buy my football boots uh, for training okay. and I get scouted by a model agency okay. so the first time I get scouted by it he gave me my number, but I didn't call him back because I wanted to play football. <laughs> so okay. it happened twice. It happened another day in town. And so I just forgot about it like, okay, I should go for it. Called the person. And um, yeah, I was a casting for Calvin Klein. And I won the casting. So this was like my, my first job. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> let's look at the picture on the screen. So nice. Tell me about it. Um, Who is the guy? What are you wearing? What's the name? Just tell me. Okay, the guy. The guy is my childhood friend. Oh. We know each other like okay. longer than 16 years. Okay. And he's also my business partner for okay. the brand. Okay. So what we're wearing, uh, 
Yeah, I'm wearing one of my blazer, and he's wearing also the, the leather jacket, it's also a sample of us, and uh, I combine it with a base cap to be a bit sporty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so you made the two. Yeah. The one you're wearing and the leather jacket. Exactly. Interesting. Very mm. nice. Yeah. You, you call it street wear. Mm. That's what I want to know. Yeah. I, I want to understand the difference. The difference. Because for us, yeah. let's say the, <laughs> the, the, the layman in the fashion world, mm. all we know is that we are covered with mm. clothes. Mm. Or the best I can say is that I'm wearing an African print because mm. there is a touch of Africa mm. in there. Mm. Okay. But for you to say this is street wear, yeah. this is so so and so wear. We yeah. have a lot of wear and a yeah. lot of clothing yeah. line. What makes this different from the others okay uh, let me call it like this streetwear is what you wear usually okay. casually okay. like a jeans okay. t-shirts okay. caps so okay and um we call the streetwear cause the birth is on the street means um you need to be creative let's say you have a pair of jeans and you don't like it anymore <laughs> okay so you need to be creative somehow okay. maybe you put colors on it maybe okay. you cut it maybe you change some stuff okay. maybe you put some other um let's say other maybe leather parts okay. or other parts onto onto the the wearing you have so okay. that's why we call it street and okay. it's more inspired by people you see around, around you us. and the normal daily basis okay yeah. Anyway, this is executive streetwear. Let me put it like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, we have to end it here. Yeah. I'll let you just, um, if somebody wants to get to know you, if you're on social yeah. media, yeah. yeah, you can announce those platforms, but we can start following you. Okay, yeah, um, I'm, 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 I'm mainly use Instagram. Instagram. It's the only app I really okay. use. Okay. So, at Donaldson Saki. Okay. So, you find me on Instagram and, uh, and okay. also... Like sending me a message. I also reply. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it's difficult, but okay. if anybody has question about my wear or okay. want to see something or okay. showroom, okay. I'm often Ghana like nearly every month. Okay. So yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um since you've been here, mm. let me just add this before you go. Mm. How has it been the fashion in Ghana, the fashion mm. industry mm. here mm. in Ghana? Mm. How are you embracing it? Um, I really like it because uh, like five years ago or longer, it was not that improving like mm. this. But I think there's still space for improvement, okay. like if I compare to maybe South Africa or okay. Nigeria. Okay. So I think they should give more platform okay. for the creative people, okay. for the fashion designer okay. to, to, uh, to, to show their brand. So okay. it's improving. Okay. But there's still more, <laughs> more, more, more work to do. <laughs> okay, yeah. so the fashion industry in Ghana is improving, but there is still more room. Uh, that is from Donaldson. And if, if nothing at all, I have learned today with you, the yeah. interview, that uh, the things we call normal, you know, here we say normal, wear. oh, it's normal wear, normal wear, just a jeans and a top, yeah. it's normal wear. Now, it's, there's a name, street wear. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. it's not just a normal wear. Yeah. Okay, all we know is that is this office wear we say office wear yeah. so you have to be formal yeah. normal wear oh just be in your jeans and, and all that but now there's a name yeah. a special name to that yeah. thank you so much for thank coming you. donaldson all right so